Well, take a look here, live at the Duke Energy outage map. The height of the storm, more than 120,000 homes and businesses lost service in Wednesday's storms. Tonight, fewer than 400 customers in Gaston County and more than 700 in Mecklenburg are waiting for their electricity to come back on. Duke managers are working to get most of the outages cleared up by midnight tonight. Well, Duke Energy crews are hard at work trying to remove the down lines and string the new ones. This afternoon's passing showers paused some of that work. Many homeowners expect to continue their cleanup over the weekend. Uh, I was in Charlotte early this morning by uh, Mount Holly, and I seen three uh, utility trucks getting on the interstate. Boom, boom, once they, uh, off the ramp, I said, oh, I, wonder, I, I hope they go in the gas town. And sure enough, that's where they were going, right up here on uh, 321, right down here. You know, utility crews from across the Carolinas are assisting local Duke Energy workers in restoration efforts. And the Red Cross is helping out those folks in Gaston County who don't have power or worse, even a place to live due to the storms. A shelter is open in Dallas at the Citizens Resource Center. Red Cross officials want to make those displaced feel right at home, offering a comfy bed, breakfast, lunch and dinner and a hot shower. Pets are welcome too. We're here just to make sure that their pain and they don't have to think about that. Give them a time to relax uh, without having to deal with all that other stress. The Gaston County State of Emergency has ended, but the Red Cross has its shelter in Dallas that will remain open 24-7 for now.